I know there are a lot of things wrong in our community, but this is powerful. In less than two years, the Louisville Urban League raised $43 million to build the Norton Healthcare Sports and Learning Complex. Even though it's getting ready for an upcoming track and field meet, the venue isn't just for sports. It's important for us, for everybody to understand that the Louisville Urban League is a civil rights organization and that it is a civil rights organization that built this facility. So this is a sports facility indeed, but it is also a learning center. When you first walk into the building, images of what was happening in Louisville during the construction of the venue are on display, including activists and other voices of Black Louisville. Then come the pillars of what the Urban League stands for, education, jobs, and justice, just to name a few. And we needed to tell that story too and to be honest about what we were feeling and experiencing even as we were building. The building is located in West Louisville, where it was once contaminated land. Louisville Urban League President Sadiq Reynolds says it was crucial to put this type of economic opportunity in the West End. I came here for college. There hasn't been any real significant investment that would bring disposable income into this part of the community that would help with property values and all of those things. So people who live here, I mean, there is excitement. The facility has rock climbing, mini bowling, and a space to hold a number of events, including concerts. And it's not just what will go on inside this building. Reynolds foresees even more good happening outside these walls, especially in the West End. We have a lot of opportunities, and, and that's all we were really trying to do is create opportunities for our community. The Urban League had to borrow about $10 million to help finish the project. So with that, Reynolds says there's still plenty of corporate sponsorship opportunities. In Louisville, Deuce Woodson, WLKY News.